The prosecution called this scenario an organized torture chamber. They say the defendants knew exactly what they were doing when they taped a juvenile to a chair. According to police, this happened in the basement of 10 White Terrace in Auburn a few days after Christmas. In court documents, this all started with a home invasion the day before the alleged torture. The victim telling police the defendants, four of eight suspects in court Wednesday, believe she set the home invasion up. They then allegedly duct taped her to a chair, burned her with a cigarette, and shaved her head. One of the male suspects allegedly raping her in the hours beforehand. One of the detectives testifying today actually choking up when he described meeting this victim and seeing her shaved head, that emotion spilling over into an interaction he had with the defense. The walls are finished, correct? It's not just concrete walls or dirt walls, correct? Except for the torture chamber that looks like an interrogation room. I know the media is here, and I know, I know okay. you want to ad lib, okay. but just answer my questions, please. Well, ultimately, Crystal Lugo, one of the four defendants, was held without bail. The judge did not have time to review the case for the other three defendants. They will be back in court on Friday. We're in Worcester tonight. Nicole Estefan, WCVB, News Center 5. In